so uh, if you're trying to follow along, don't try and follow along for this. There's a wiki page. Uh, if you search for GLC, you'll find it on the wiki uh, for how to install it. Um, but so I'm just going to show you really, really quickly. So the, the program is called GLC. There are two applications, GLC Capture and GLC Play. You have to run Arviz un underneath GLC Capture. So GLC crap Capture and then the command that you're about to run. So Ross run Arviz Arviz. And this should just pop up like normal. Um, now, in order to start recording, uh, if I hit Shift F9, that's going to start recording. I can move around. I can do whatever I want. It, it may slow things down. It takes a little bit of uh, processing power to grab all of the data off the GPU. If I hit Shift F9 again. It's going to stop recording. And if I close Arviz and I look in here, there's now this GLC file, which I can play with GLC play. This GLC file is not a standard video format. Uh, there are instructions on the wiki for how to convert this file into an AVI or MP4, anything, pretty much anything you want. So the last thing that I'm going to show you here, um, I mentioned before that there are two ways of getting data into Arviz. One of them are these displays, and another one are markers. Well, markers are actually a different kind of display. Um, so if you go to Add and you go to Markers, uh, that's going to show up and you subscribe to a topic like usual. The de it defaults here to the visualization mark marker topic. Um, and I'm just going to show you a little demonstration of what you can do with markers. So I have this little node called Marker Shmup. Uh, it's actually broadcasting in a different frame, a different topic. And so this is a little game I put together just for fun to kind of see exactly what was possible and how performant markers were. Uh, so this is completely an outside application. There is nothing written specially in Arviz for this. Uh, the text is a little bit hacked, but that's fixed in a new version of Arviz. Um, and so all of these things are just being broadcast from another node that is reacting to input from some other ROS topics that I dreamt up. Um, and you can actually play it. And I'll, I'll make this code available to you guys. I'll show you the, the SVN URL in a little bit if you're, if you're interested. <laughs> uh, so there's this high score list on the wiki. Uh, or if there isn't right now, there will be. But. Uh, and so that's, that's essentially it for, what, for the, the can demo. Um, if you guys have any questions or you want me to show something else or you're, you're confused with anything right now, no? All right. Uh, and so then I'm just going to leave you guys to some playtime. Um, so the Arvis docs are right there. There's some marker tutorials. And you're welcome if you just want to play around with the sensor data, play around with the robot seed in Arviz, that's fine. Uh, but if you want a goal and you want to start sending some markers, learning how to do that stuff, uh, try to have, a, have it draw a trail of boxes along the path of the gripper as the gripper moves. Um, and for anyone, Jeremy went over how to do an overlay, but here's how to create an overlay maybe a little bit easier. Um, and so you probably want to do all of this on the robot. So go, play. NVIDIA. There's going to be this NVIDIA CG toolkit. If you go to mark for reinstallation and then hit apply, that should reinstall it and everything should work fine after that. Uh, if things are still having problems, let me know.